Okay guys, welcome back to my Undertale. Last time we left off, we did not be undying, so let's do it. I wanna do this. Okay, I got I got better item. As long as you can cannot escape. This game's head on. You won't last the second against me alone, well, I probably will last. This is where I need all the healing items. Okay. Oh my god, I actually did it! Okay, go. Go, 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 Ring. Hey, what's up? I was just thinking. You, me, and Undyne should all hang out sometime. After you hang out with me. Let's meet up at her house. I think you will make great pals. Ah! Oh. Stop running away! I made her mad. Idiot. Oh! oh. What happens if 
Give one down the water. <laughs> She's like, what just happened? Well. I'm just going to take all the water. Hey, Smith. We're done here. Yeah. We already apologized, so if that's not good enough, that's all. Okay, are you just kidding? It's not enough. I spent six hours filling these balloons with paint, and I'm feeling thrilling. Unless you're cool with everyone seeing that mural. We're cool with it. In fact, we're going to show it to them. Uh, we are? Yes, we just agreed on it, but you were too busy enjoying your lady shoes. It's just that they look like a dressy shoe, but feel like a sneaker. Hey, uh, six thirty six o'clock. Time to unveil our mural. Yeah, but before we show it to you, Lady Major. Yeah. Yeah. All right, but for real, I could do that all day, but right now, all right, fills you with the time. Oh my god. I didn't expect you to show up so soon. I haven't showered. I'm not I'm barely dressed. It's all messy and Um hey. I'm Dr. Alphys. I'm Asgore's royal scientist. Uh I'm not one of the bad guys. Actually, since you stepped out of the ruins, I've um been observing your journey through console your your fights your friendship everything i was only going to stop you but watching someone on the screen really makes you so uh, now i want to help you using my knowledge i can easily guide you through hotland i know a way right to asgore's castle no problem well actually uh there's just a tiny issue a long time ago i made a robot named Metadon. Wait, what? Originally, I built him to be an entertainment robot. Uh, you know, like a robot TV star. Anyway, recently, recently, I decided to make him useful. You know, just some small part practical adjustments. Like, um, anti-human combat figures. Of course, when I saw you coming, I immediately decided. I had to remove those features. Unfortunately, I made a teensy mistake while doing so, and um, now he's an unstoppable killing machine with a thirst for human blood. <laughs> uh, uh. But um, hopefully, we don't run into him. Uh oh. Do you hear something? Oh no. Oh yes. Welcome beauties. Tune to today's quiz show. Uh oh. Oh boy, I can already tell it's gonna be a great show. Everyone give a big hand for our wonderful contestant. No Alphys? Never played before, gorgeous. No problem, it's simple. There's only one rule. Answer correctly. Or you die. Dun 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 Act um check. Metaton ten attack nine 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 defense. Its mental body renders him invulnerable to attack. Let's start with an easy one. What's the prize for answering correctly? D. 
right. Looks like you got it. Oh. Here's your terrific prize. What's the king's full name? Correct. What a terrific answer. Enough about you. Let's talk about me. What are robots made of? Too easy for you, huh? Look at Alphys. <laughs> Here's another easy one for you. Two trains. Train A, train B. So to me, little, 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 little. Wow, I'm astounded, folks. Don't count on your victory. How many flies are in this jar? Looks like uh, 53 to me, but I don't care. Spare. Let's play a memory game. What monster is this? Boy, that's embarrassing. Jeez, dude. But can you get this on? What you smoothie ghost? <laughs> Love it. Here's the simple one. How many letters in Metaton? Time to bring out the big guns. In the dating simulation video game, Yumi Kissy Cutie, what is Mimi's favorite food? In the fortune friend buys all the ice cream for her friend, but it's all snail flavored and she only one likes it. It's one of my favorite parts in the game because it's actually a powerful magic about friendship and... Alphys, Alphys, Alphys. You aren't helping the contestant, are you? Uh, you should have told me. I'll ask a question. You'll be sure to know the answer. Who does Al Dr. Alphys have a crush on? Hmm. That's actually one of the questions I've never actually noticed. Because I never... I... Wait, wasn't it online? <gasps> it was! See, Alphys, I told you it was obvious. Even the human figured it out. Yes, she scrambled her name in margins of her nose. She programmed variables after her. She even writes stories about them together. Sh sharing a domestic life. Pro probability of crush, 101%. Margin error, 1%. Well, well, well. With Dr. Elvis helping you, this show has no dramatic tension. We can't go on like this, but, 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 this was the pilot episode. Next up, more drama, Rom more romance, more bloodshed. Till next time, darlings. Well, that was certainly something. Wait, wait. Let me give you my phone number. Then maybe I could. If you need help, I could. Where'd you get that? Get that phone? It's ancient. It doesn't even have texting. Wait a second. Please. Rest in pieces, whatever that was. Here, I upgraded it for you. I, it can do texting items. It got a keychain. I even signed you up for the Underground's number one social network. Now we're officially friends. <laughs> I'm gonna. I'm going to the restroom. All right, let's continue onwards. Alpha status update. Just realized I didn't watch Undying Fight the Human. Not well. Actually, I want to go back because I want to do that date with Papyrus. The space behind the.
Or am I the river woman? Doesn't really matter. Uh, let's go to Snowden because I want to do that date with the pirate. Again, sometime. Tra la la. So you came back to have a demon. Yeah, well, I'm going to work on my car. Alright. You want me to come with you? Came whenever you're ready. Alright. Hey, everybody. Welcome. Yes. Well, I'm back. Alright, So, you came back to have a date with me. You must really be serious about this. I'll have to take you someplace really special. A place I like to spend a lot of my time. Um, my house. All right. Hey guys, I'm going to date. Step on, press C. Alright, so you're going to have to do it. Alright, so you're going to have to do it. see it working. Okay, forget it. I think we're ready for step two. Step two. <laughs> you man. Oh, wow, That can really hurt. Wait a second. My clothing. You're wearing clothing right now. No. You planned it all. You're way better than you know. No, you're dating power. Don't think you're you best of me. I, the great papyrus, have never been beating a dating adult, and I never will. I can easily use seeing the fact I got special clothing. Behold. Man, what do you think? I love it. No. A genuine compliment. However, you don't truly understand. Therefore, what you just said is felon, then dating won't escalate any further unless you find a secret. But that won't happen. Already know where it is, papyrus. My hat, my hat, my hat! Came back my hat! Alright. Spaghetti. Alright. Okay. Alright. Perfect. Oh. Uh, er. No. I'm canceling spot A tomorrow. Instead, you're gonna help Jackson's chores. A nice sandwich, huh, kid? You can have, uh, 16 to 44. Human is clear now. You're madly in love with me. Everything you do, everything you say. All been for my sake. Human, I want you to be happy too. It's time for my to express my feelings. It's time that I told you I papyrus. I um boy. The hunt here is just me. Oh shoot, human, I 
I'm sorry. I don't like you like the way you like me. Romantically, I mean, I mean, I tried very hard to. I thought that because you flirted with me that I was supposed to go on a date with you. Then, on the day, feelings were blossom forth. We do match your passion with me. But alas, I don't care if I have failed. I feel just the same as before. And instead, by dating you, I've only drawn me deeper into your intense love with me. A dark prison, prison of passion with no escape. However, I mean, how could I have done this to my dear friend? No, wait, that's wrong. I can't fail at anything. Human, I'll help you through these trying times. I'll... And act like this all never happened. After all, you are very great. It would be tragic to lose your friendship. So please, don't cry because I won't kiss you. Because I don't have any lips. And hey, someday you'll find someone as great as me. Well, no, that's not true. But I'll help you settle for a second best. Yeah. Oh, and if you ever really need to reach me, get my phone number. You can call me any time. Platonically. Well, gotta go. Yeah. Hey, uh, everyone, this is Derek. Hey. More kids. Uh, yeah, yeah, uh, that's Jackson and Ramona, the twins. And you know Max. <laughs> and of course, my housekeeper and my au pair. <laughs> Kids, mommy says homework and straight to bed. Uh, au pair, uh, have them brush their teeth before bed, and housekeeper, just stay out of the Be right back. So now we have the Pirates and Sands to our collection. You know what that means. Let's go get Undyne. Now, I think Undyne's at... Tra la la, can you say right? Get in the boat? Yes. Where will we be going today? Waterfall. Then we're off. Yeah. Oh, my class, Flagina? Are you kidding? I could have sworn there was a duck hiding in this room. You are going to rock your school side. Tra la la, Timmy Village. It's right before the darkening lantern room. Down. Alrighty. Come and get him, Dad. Trouble. You could make or break second grade. Okay, Max. I was keeping this a secret in case you absolutely needed it. But this. I want to save real quick. Is my super magic scarf. The first time I came to the real club, I was terrified. Until okay. I put this bad boy on. Then what happened? I got super brave. I did a killer set, and I got a standing ovation. Course, I'll be right back when I'm with Papyrus and Undying. What? 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 Who was it? I knew it. Freya, who's bashing? Undying's playing the piano. Oh, the human arrived. Are you ready to hang out with Undying? I have a plan to make you two great friends. Will you hang out? Yes. Okay, stand behind me. Sure to give her this. She loves these. Oh wow, that's such a Hi Papyrus. Ready for your extreme private one-on-one -on -one training? You bet I am, and I brought a friend. Hi, I don't think we <laughs> Why don't you two come in? He wants a date in three to five years. He hears someone shouting at I told you, I'm not in No, you can't escape friendship. Can escape okay, fine. I'm not ready to I leave. Here, Undyne, my friend brought you a gift a gift for you. On your own. Uh, thanks. I'll uh, play it with the others. Uh, 
So, are we ready to start? Whoopsie doopsie, I just remembered. I have to go to the bathroom. You do have fun. Why? Well, so why are you here? To rub your victory in my face to you? Is that it? No. Then why are you here? Wait, I get it. You think that I'm gonna be friends with you, huh? Right. Never with you, yes. Really? How delightful, I accept it. Let's all frolic in the... Feel the friendship. Not... Why would I ever be friends with you? If you were my house guest, I'd beat you up right now. You're the enemy of everyone's hopes and dreams. I will never be your friend. Now, get out of my house. Dang, that was a shame. I thought Undyne could be friends with you. But I guess I over I over estimate her. She's just not up to the challenge. Challenge? What? The virus? Wait a second! Dang it! I mean, darn it! He thinks I can be friends with you? <laughs> what a joke. I would make. I wouldn't. I can make friends with a wimpy loser like you every day. Listen up, human. We're not just gonna be friends. We're gonna be. Besties. I'll make you. You like me so much, you won't be able to think of anyone else. <laughs> it's a perfect revenge. Why don't you have a seat? Oh, leaving so soon. No, you're not. Too bad, no nerds allowed. Well, maybe some nerds. Then why do you go in there? <gasps> okay, I'm sorry. Let me sit down. Sit down and progress? Yes. Sit comfortable? I'll get you something to drink. I'll have some iced tea with, with sauce. Oh! Hey! Don't get up. You're the guest. Sit down. That's pretty funny. Oh, soda. Actually, even though you point into it, you don't look happy. Heh, that's fine. I think so is gross too. It rots your teeth, it rots your mind, it rots your frightened spirit. Oh. Um, are you hitting on me? Try to throw the spear in your face? Tea? Huh? Coming right up. Yeah! Tea, bro! Even though I have OJ. Take a mo moment for the water to boil. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> okay, it's all done. Here we are. Careful, it's hot. It's not that hard. Just drink it already. Take a sip. Take a sip. It's burning. But other than that, it's pretty good. It's pretty good, right? Nothing but the best for my absolutely precious best friend. Our APS. 
or APF, Shreddy. I mean, APFF. Hey, you know, it's kind of strange you chose that tea. Golden flower tea. That's as we favorite kind. Actually, now that I think about it, you kind of remind me of him. You're both total weenie. Sort of. You know, I was a pretty hot, heavy kid. Want to prove I was the strongest, I tried to fight Asgore. Emphasis on tried. I couldn't land a single blow on him. And worse, the whole time he refused to fight back. I was so humiliated. Afterwards, he apologized and said, Something gooey. Excuse me, do you know... Do you want to know how to beat me? I said yes. And from then on, he trained me. One day, during practice, I finally knocked him down. I felt bad. But he was beaming. I've never seen someone more proud to get their butt kicked. Anyway, long story short, he kept training me. And now I'm the head of the Royal Guard. So I'm the one who gets to train the doors how to fight. Like a papyrus. But, um, to be honest with you, I don't know if I can ever let Papyrus into the world, but don't tell him that I said that. He just, well, I mean, it's not that he's weak. He's actually pretty freaking tough. It's just that he's, he's too innocent and nice. I mean, look, he was supposed to capture you, and he ended up becoming friends with you instead. I can never send him into battle. He'd get ripped into tiny, smiling shreds. This is, that's part of why I started teaching him how to cook, you know. So, um, maybe he could do something else with his life. Oh, sorry, I'll, I was talking for so long. You're out of tea, aren't you? I'll get you some more. Wait a second. Papyrus, it's cooking lesson. He was supposed to have that right now. And he's not here to have it. You'll have to ha have it for him. Oh no. So, undying. That's right. Nothing. Papyrus and I closer to cooking. Which means that if I give you his lesson, we'll become closer than you can ever imagine. Bah <laughs> Afraid we're gonna be the friends. Oh, ow! Let's start with the sauce. Envision these ve envision these vegetables as your greatest enemy. Now, pound them to dust. Strong. You punch the vegetable. Four, four, four. Knock over the tomato. Yeah, yeah. Our hearts are uniting against these healthy ingredients. Now it's my turn. No! Uh, we'll just create this into the bowl later. But for now, <laughs> we have to add the noodles. Homemade noodles are the best. But I just buy a store right. They're the cheapest. No! Uh, just. Put them in the pot. Fiercely. Throw everything into the pot as hard as you can, including the box. To clean them together at the end of the day. Yeah! I'm into it! Alright, now turn up the stir pasta. As general the uh, Alright. Better than this, ready? Let's do it. Stir harder! 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 Let me do it. <laughs> That's the stuff. Alright, now for the final step. Turn up the heat. Let the stove top symbolize the potion. Let your hopes and dreams turn into the burn fire. Ready? Don't hold back. Hotter. Undyne. We're gonna burn out the house. Hotter, darn it! Oh crap! Hotter! Wait, that's too. Uh, 
Ah. So, ne what's next? Great fucking friendship. Oh, who am I kidding? I just really screwed this up, didn't I? I can't force you to like me, human. Some people just don't get along with each other. I understand if you feel that way about me, and if we can't be friends, that's okay. Because if we're not friends, it means I can destroy you without regret. Oh, I've been defeated. My house is in a shabble. I even failed to befriend you. That's it. I don't care if you're my guest anymore. One final rematch. On both sides, the only way I could regain my lost pride. Now, come on, hit me with all you got. Show me what you got. Do your worst. What's the matter, scared? What the heck are, is the holdup? Come on already. It's getting hotter in here. Oh wow. Oh no. The oh! Oh! Well, what? That's the best you can manage? Even attacking at full force? You just can't master any intent to hurt me. <laughs> you know what? I don't actually want to hurt you either. First, I hated your stupid... What that freak? Yeah, but... The way you hit me right now... Remind me of someone I used to play. Now... Now I know you're not just someone to work. You're a wimpy weasel with a big heart. Just like him. Listen, human. It seems that you were an ad for our fake fight. You know him? He probably doesn't want to. Talk to him. I'm sure you could play him and let your heart. Eventually, some mean human will fall down here. And I'll take their stone. That makes sense, right? <laughs> oh, and if you do hurt Asbor, I'll take the human souls, cross the barrier, and beat the heck out of you. That's what friends are for, right? Yep. <laughs> now let's get the heck out of this. Oh, the swimming house. Yeah, I think that's for the best. Whoop, that was fun, huh? We'll have to hang out another time. But, uh, somewhere else, I guess. In the meantime, I'll, I guess I'll go out and hang out with the virus. So if you need to, if you need me, drop by snow then, okay? Oh, and if you ever need help, just give the virus a ring, okay? Since we're in the same spot, I'll be able to talk to you, too. We'll see you later, punk. Yeah. Are you still alive? I'll be right back.